Assalamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. In today's video we're going to be taste testing another Samyang Ramen. Today's Samyang Ramen flavor is... The original Samyang flavor! Now this was the first ever Samyang flavor made. Now I'm going to be showing you everything up close, the front, the back, all the details. Let's get to the kitchen and cook this up. Follow me. So everyone, we're here in the kitchen and this is... These are the noodles we'll be cooking. I told you I'll, I'm going to show you everything up close. So here it is. This is Samyang Ramen since 1963. This is the original flavor. It's halal certified, so it's safe to eat for Muslims. And here, it's saying this is noodle soup. I don't know what flavor this is though. What, what flavor is it? This? this is the bag. We have the cooking directions. Put the noodles, soup base and flakes into 550 ml of boiling water and cook for 4 minutes. For better taste, add fresh vegetables and scallions. So these noodles are cooked very differently than the typical Samyang ramen that we have tasted before. I've opened the Samyang ramen. Ooh. So here are the flakes. Here is the soup in orange packaging, but the soup is in powder form. This is not liquid. This is not liquid. And here are, this is the noodle cake or noodle block. So the noodles are made from wheat flour, palm oil, tapioca starch, potato starch, salt, emulsifier, soybean oil, acidity regulator, potassium carbonate, sodium carbonate, sodium phosphate, dibasic, what? Citric acid, water, thickener, guar gum, green tea flavor oil. Let's turn on the heat. I'm going to cook it in the frying pan. I do have 550 ml of boiling water ready. I'm going to add all of that. Next, it tells us to add the noodle block. This is the first time I've actually broken the noodle block. Don't forget the stragglers. There you go. The flake packet consists of dried carrot flake, dried bok choy, dehydrated chives, dried cabbage flakes. Okay, let me open it. Can you see all the different vegetables? It's adding such a beautiful color. Let me add that in. In y'all go. Nice. So we also have to add the soup base. Open from here. <gasps> oh, I did not expect that. I did not expect the actual soup powder to be so orange. That is orange. So the soup powder contains soy sauce powder, yeast extract powder, flavor enhancer, monosodium glutamate, disodium, ribonucleotide, salt, sugar, wheat flour, rice powder, mixed spicy powder, chili, garlic, onion, chili extract powder, black pepper powder, red pepper powder, palm oil, onion powder, paprika extract color, caramel powder, garlic flavor oil. I am going to use my tutti putti doi. You know what that smells like? That is such a nostalgic smell. You know what it smells like? It smells like chips Oman. So let me cover this and let this cook for four minutes. I'm going to set the timer for four minutes. See ya in four. Bye. Okay, four minutes are up. It literally smells like those Oman chips. The spicy ones. The, uh, or the potato sticks with the spicy ones. It is, you cannot deny the smell. This smell is just, oof. Mm. Uh -oh. I always burn noodles, like, why? <laughs> and this one didn't cook great. Okay, let me just show you up close. Yes. That looks delicious. Okay, let's go over. To our plate. Mmm, looks delicious. There is no soup. Like all the water is like gone by the noodles. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. First you. Mmm, 
How is that? Is that good? Mm, okay. My turn. Bismillah ar Mmm. Oh, that is... That is tasty. These noodles are not spicy. You can totally make your own things with these. Add vegetables, meat, make it soupy, make it dry like this. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I still prefer that the way that you cook the noodles, drain, and then put it into a soup, like different seasoning and soup. It's, I to feel this way, it's really starchy. Ah, perfect for cold weather. Mm. What? You want more? Why didn't you say so? You just did. Mm. Okay, to be honest, I've had the spicy Samyang ramen, so this to me tastes very bland. I don't know what it is, but they're perfect for those who cannot, they cannot stomach very spicy foods. It's perfect for them. And I really love like the bit of carrot, the bok choy, the cabbage leaves going through. Because you're kind of getting like, a, like bits of different textures as well. Mm. So I'm going to end my video right here. I'm going to go and enjoy these noodles on this very cold, cold, cold day in Lahore. It's, it's unbelievably cold. Uh, you saw the fog, right? Mm -hmm. that's, how, that's how cold it is. Ah. Mm -mm. So everyone, if you really enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press the bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post, leave a constructive comment, and share this video. I'll really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah Hafiz. Bye. Tasakallah khair, thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here. Check it out. Some days your head is in the clouds. Every now and then the clouds come down to you to ignite your creativity. By Sky McNeil. At the chalaya, ek ho. Acha, dud wala lag gaya. Motorbike wala lag gaya. Rickshaw wala chala gaya. Dusre rickshaw wala lag gaya. Oh, 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 oh